So I'm heading to Egypt tomorrow. I am flying at 6.15 tomorrow evening. So I've got about 23 hours until I fly and I have done nothing. So yeah, I need to sort out a lot. I need to firstly pack, buy some books. That's literally the most unimportant thing I need to do. <laughs> I need to go and get loads of food to take in my suitcase. Obviously with COVID and all the rules, it's gonna be a bit different out there because we usually we're able to do whatever we like. But um, this time around, like, we obviously have to keep our distance from all the players again, completely isolate. But the best thing about this is obviously the weather's gonna be amazing and we're allowed to go outside and we can sit by the pool. I mean. Woohoo! I'm so excited and I'm so excited to see everyone again already. <laughs> Other than that, I've just got a lot to sort out. I need to pack, which is gonna take me forever because I'm just the slowest person. I'm trying to think what else I need to say. I went to get my coronavirus test and I tested negative, so I'm definitely going, so that's the best bit to hear. Yeah, let's just get started. I'm off to go get my COVID test. Fingers crossed it all goes well. <laughs> I just got back from the COVID test and oh my days, another level of how much better that was than the one I got last time. Last time they literally fully burnt my nose from twisting the cotton bud so hard and this time it didn't even hurt. So that's great, but well, I'm actually quite nervous because they said they couldn't guarantee whether it was going to get back in time. So I was a bit like, oh damn. I was a bit too scared to ask if I could film it because they are very obviously wanting us to come in and out as quick as we can because of COVID and all that. So yeah, I didn't actually ask. So today is traveling day. I have not really packed very well, but I need to go now. So I'm excited. I'm very nervous because two of our PSA players just pulled out because they're tested positive. So yeah i'm a bit anxious but we'll go over it. it's fine so i'm on the way to the airport i'm excited nervous um got a mixture of everything right now so yeah i'm excited and i think i've packed everything i need hopefully i hope so i sure do hope so all right man. We have literally got the whole of PSA on our flight. We've got Holly, we've got Lucy, we've got Deck, we've got Walla, we've got Ben, we've got Tom, we've got George, we've got Nathan, we've got Haley. We've got the PSA, we've got James, we've got everyone. We're here at Terminal 5, Gate C57. We've all made it to the flight. And here we have a wild Jasmine Hutton in her natural habitat ready to board her flight to Cairo. We're at our gate. Patrick is on the seat behind me. Yeah. It's so quiet here, I can't even believe it. They're automatically. It's got on the plane. If you're wearing a face mask, this should Literally be removed before this final oxygen mask. Stay in your seats so and pull good, the mask towards you. Face the oxygen mask over your mouth and yeah, nose. I'm really excited. I'm breathing normally, adjusting the band to your Hey guys, it's me, just on the plane, hope you're all well. so late we've just got to the hotel and this is 1 52 in the morning i am so tired i can't wait to go to sleep i've literally just anti-backed everything into the room uh wiped all the surfaces just because i'm a bit anxious um other than that i've got a test at 11 a.m which i'm excited to take <laughs> um 
and yeah i'll give you more insight about everything tomorrow because i am so tired and i just want to go to sleep so see you guys tomorrow good morning everyone it is 10 45 the next morning i am really tired because i didn't sleep very well and i managed to go to sleep at 3 a.m and yeah so not ideal but i am off now to go get my coronavirus test and i'm gonna have to isolate in this room for the rest of the day so see you in a bit This is the pool. It is so hot. I'm not dressed. Alright. Like this is so nice. My room is over there. We're right by the pyramid. Whoop, whoop. So big, isn't it? <laughs> Pat's never seen a pyramid before. And there's two. There's loads. They're so cool. I literally look exhausted. You can tell from my eyes. It is like two o'clock now and I am starving so I just ordered some room service and I got some baba ganoush and hummus with bread and I'm so hungry and it looks so good so I can't wait to eat that it's gonna be so yummy this is the view from my room how nice is it it's not as nice as everyone else everyone else has got a pyramid view and I don't but I mean as far as pretty outside things go it's pretty pretty to me and then i'll give you the room tour to my like little balcony through here it's my little desk where i eat my room service my little lounge if you call it that my bed and yeah my little hand wipes i've been they've been helping me throughout this week my food here's the lounge what? Here's the bathroom and yeah, and the shower. Yeah, it's pretty nice. That is basically the room. Oh, I want to see my friends. Mm. It's like 7.45 now, so I haven't got that much longer. I'm like praying that we get our results back today, but I don't think we will. But yeah, this is a bit later now. I can just watch a film and go to sleep. <laughs> very happy with this meal i actually forgot to mention as well i got the nicest drink i got a mango juice their mango juices are so nice i'm so bored i've watched so much youtube and netflix already i don't know what else i can do peace my test came back negative I am so excited now. I am in the tournament bubble. Good morning, everybody. Today I've got a practice court at 7 p.m. We're really excited to play some squash, but um, until then, I've got nothing else to do, so I am gonna go have some breakfast now. But um, yeah, we're in the tournament bubble now, so that basically means that we are allowed to go and sort of go outside a bit more and socialize. And, We've been still keeping two metres from everybody, but we're still able to go and see everyone else who's in the bubble and have a chat. Yeah, so I'm really excited to go and see people because yesterday was so boring. I'll see you guys in a bit. So I am, I'm not naked, I've got a bikini on. We are at the pool. I'm going to be here for the next few hours because I'm not practicing until so much later. So yeah. I am back in my room. Just ordered room service to get some lunch. So I am gonna be in my room chilling until, basically until I go for my practice court, which is that I need to leave here at five. Just about to head down to the club for my hit with Nadine. So excited to play squash finally, I've waited so long. But yeah, it's boiling. I think it's like a 45 minute journey to the club as well. So I'm gonna be there for a while and I'm gonna get this back at seven and then have some dinner with Pat and stuff. So we're at the club. These are the courts, they're brand new. I am playing on that court over there. It's the warm up area. This is where we can warm up. So 
So back now, ready to chill out. Tomorrow's match day. I'm so excited to play a match. Practice training today was really good, hitting the ball really nicely, so feeling positive. Good morning everyone, today is game day. Got my lovely morning view, blue skies. Yeah, it's game day, I'm so excited. I'm gonna go down to have some breakfast now. My pre-match food, watching the squash, and chilling. I've got about a couple of hours till I need to go for my match, so yeah, I'm just gonna relax. So it's about half an hour till I go to the club to get ready for my match at 7.15 and I am pumped. I haven't really done much today, I've just chilled out, had some lunch and just had a nap. I probably won't film now, fingers crossed it's good news. So it is the next day and it is about 10 to 11 at night. I didn't vlog any of today because I spent the whole day by the pool. So I lost my match sad times. Yeah, I'm happy that I was able to use my brain for once when everything else wasn't working. There's a lot of things that I can come out of this match better for and I know I've definitely learnt so much from this match. But yeah, I'm obviously really gutted to lose but I know I'm getting close to these top girls and I'm gonna get a win soon. I can feel it. So I need to get up at 4.30 a.m. to get the bus, we're getting a shuttle over to the airport. Tomorrow is just gonna be a hideous day, I can feel it already. Also, I actually forgot to mention that obviously during this coronavirus times, and obviously it's being really tough, but there's only so much I can vlog whilst I'm at the courts and stuff because obviously other people are playing and we're not actually allowed to watch anyone else play. Hopefully when COVID eases and things become a bit more back to normal, I'll be able to show you more insight. I've tried to give you as much as I can for this trip and I hope you guys have really enjoyed it. back home finally i didn't vlog much this morning because i was so tired i had two hours sleep before we went for our flight that wasn't ideal so i'm literally slept all afternoon so so lucky massive thanks to al for sorting out first class for some of us it was amazing i've never sat in first class before and yeah i managed to sleep loads on the flight because it was so comfortable so that's the end of my cairo vlog i hope you guys have enjoyed please smash a huge thumbs up and give it a subscribe thanks guys